All right, guys, joining us to cook in the kitchen today, Mark Georgie with All Around Town Catering. Hello. Y'all know Mark always has some really good yeah. something going on in the pot here, oh, yeah. in the pan here. What are we making today? Basil chicken over herb rice. Ooh. It's wonderful. What I do is I took some olive oil, heated it up. Uh, you'll take, uh, you can have an orange, a green, a red bell pepper, just depends on your preference. Mm -hmm. There's orange. I like the orange and purple. looks really nice together. Okay. You get that sauteing like that. We're going to have to do a little fast track today, huh? <laughs> yeah, just That's all right. We'll be all right. <laughs> okay, we have some salsa. I made some uh, salsa the other day with roasted tomatillos, uh, fire roasted tomatoes, and tomato paste. And it makes for a really, really nice uh, texture. It holds together really well. Mm -hmm. We're going to get this together like that. Um, this chicken's already grilled. I like the taste of grilled chicken a lot. Okay. Uh, we have a little chili oil. We'll do about a teaspoon, a liberal teaspoon. Now, chili oil is not something you typically find in your grocery store, so where yeah. would somebody have to go no, to find it? you can that? find it. In, 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 in any grocery Asian store. supermarkets always have it. But not, yeah. And even your regular grocery store would have it? Oh, yeah. Some form of it. They will. Okay. They will. Okay. okay, we're going to add the chicken. That's about a little less than a pound of uh, grilled chicken. Okay. Okay, we're going to add... And it's already cooked, so it's already nice and ready to go. It's really warming it up there. Our rice is going to be great. Okay. Once again, you don't have to measure perfectly, but about a tablespoon of uh, soy sauce. Soy is always good with that. A little bit of that salsa on there. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you don't want to cook the basil too much, so we're going to put that on at the very last part okay. after we uh, put the rice out, okay? And uh, it's a real fresh tasting dish. It's going to be good. really good. Yeah. Usually you can cook it for about almost, you know, eight minutes, something like that total with everything you have going on. Okay. So we'll get our rice out. This is, we put some cashews in the bottom, a little bit of olive oil. So this, okay. Herb rice. Just go like that. That smells delicious too. It is wonderful. <laughs> I love fresh herbs uh, year round, but right now basil is going crazy. Look at this. Oh yeah, it's well, super fresh. Just, oh yeah. They grow between the garage doors. <laughs> 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 anyway, uh, this is almost, it's probably pretty close to done, so we'll go ahead and do it. Since everything's already fully cooked, except for the vegetables, which I like a little crunch anyway, mm -hmm. uh, you can plate this however you want. You can put it around, put the vegetables around, get your chicken, some in the middle, and you go like that. And you'll have a great dish, watch this. And then we're going to garnish it with the green onions, the scallions, and the, uh, the basil like this. You can even use a little lime juice if you want. Mm. But uh, there it is. That's the quick that version. Super That's the easy. quick version. I mean, that, <laughs> but that was super easy, though, it is. as always with Mark George. Yeah, super easy dish. So, That's a lot of different so good. flavors. Yeah. Good summertime dish. Oh, and yeah. we'll have that recipe on our website for you later on this afternoon. In the meantime, Definitely. let's check in with Jill. It is hot outside.